It is election day. You have up until 8 o'clock to turn in your ballots here. Here, I'm here at Jackson County Elections Office here off of West Mayor, where we've had people drop off their ballots all morning. And it's going to be a busy day today at local elections offices as there's some big measures and big races on this primary election ballot. Now, in Jackson County, Chris Walker said the Jackson County clerk, there's about 35% of registered voters that have already submitted their ballots. And she says that number is expected to skyrocket before the 8 p.m. deadline tonight. She says that the past two years has been up to 37%, but she says since we're already at 35, she she expects that number to even go higher. And with big money measures like the GMO and the tight sheriff's race, she says more people are coming out to vote to have their voices be heard. The GMO measure 15119 is the most expensive measure in the county's history when it comes to campaign spending with nearly $1.3 million for this campaign. And most of that money is coming from out of state. Now, the campaign supporting the GMO bill has spent about $400,000. The campaign against the GMO bill has spent about $800,000 from out of state corporations like Syngenta footing about half of the bill. But again, you have up until 8 o'clock tonight to turn in these ballots. Again, I'm here off West Main, but we're going to have a list of just the locations you can drop these off tonight. You have up until 8 o'clock. Covering your news live in Medford, Molly Trotter, News 10. Good morning. Okay.